Hello boys and girls, it's time for story time with Hobo Ryan. Today we're going to start off with the old Christmas classic, uh, ladies and gentlemen, Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. Rudolph, your nose is so bright. The fuck? Beats the heck out of me, Rudolph says. I don't know how a animal can generate such energy through his nose. Don't worry, old boy. There's a man named Tesla who's, who's got your back. Oh wow, this story gets really sad afterwards. You know what? Let's not read it. This isn't worth it. This isn't worth it. <laughs> you want to know what I was really looking at? Just titties. Hello everybody and welcome to another Ryan Reacts. Today we're checking out another Ruby episode and that episode is Ruby Volume 4 Chapter 10 Kuro Yuri. So ladies and gentlemen, this, 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 this moment right here sitting down is, it's important. I am going to watch the last three episodes of season four. This is the last stretch. This is the final stretch of Ruby Miss. It's kind. It's kind of sad, really. I really have enjoyed this. Uh, this month of just watching Ruby, even though it has been quite stressful. Um, it has been really fun, and I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, I should really save this for the last episode. <laughs> In the last episode, Cargo Pants and Yang went outside and had a good old-fashioned sparring. And then after losing, Cargo Pants sucker punched his daughter right in the face. <laughs> I don't care what his explanation was for in that episode where he's just like, Well, you gotta learn you can't be so angry all the time. So maybe someday his daddy will come out of nowhere and sucker punch you. <laughs> nah, dad, I think that's just you being a piece of dog shit, bud. I said dog shit because the Y was in the episode. Yes! More the Y, please. Can we have a whole episode of the Y just walking around? Just an episode of him just going out in the woods, killing Osama Bin Laden. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like that'd be a good arc. Also in the last episode, Weiss made a golem and Blake was fighting a chameleon ninja. And while they're sitting there thinking how bad their lives are, Crow's vomiting up blueberry jam. You remember this, Weiss. You remember this. <laughs> the worst part is, I literally imagine, like, he's just like, <coughs> Ruby just goes like this. Thanks, Uncle Crow. I love blueberry jam. Of course, folks, if you like, check out the original link and more from original content credit. The link will be in the description. I have no idea what this episode is going to entail, but it's got a baby wren on it. So that probably means he's going to die. <laughs> I do not feel safe, guys. I don't. That last episode was like glaring in bright letters, foreshadowing over and over again as, Hey, let's split up. Uh, yeah, we'll be fine. And John be like, it won't be fine. I've been here way too many times to know this ain't going to be fine. Of course, it could be just Rooster Teeth, you know, pulling a fast one on me. Probably is. But part of me... Feels like they're going to kill off Ren or Nora, or both. You, there's a quota, folks! There's a death quota now. They killed three people last season. You really think they're going to go the whole season without killing somebody? And if they don't, oh, season five's going to be a freaking bloodbath. <gasps> Are we going to get the more tales of Felipe? What was his real name? Oscar. Is that where, is that where Osprey was? Of course, I should have known he was hiding in a backpack the whole time. <laughs> was it ghost? He's just picking his head out. Oscar, I'm stuck. Please help. Please call the fire department. I'm sorry. I'm, you know, I'm sorry I made you run away from home. Feels. Maybe, maybe not. Leaving home is crazy. Maybe not the best advice for a principal. Everything you've told me is completely crazy. But it doesn't feel crazy anymore. It feels like I'm doing the right thing. Well, I suppose that's good. No. That's scary. 
You know, I would say the same thing if an old man was talking to me in my own head and just kind of accepted it. You don't even know who Ozpin is. You don't know his resume or anything. Sure, he could be a principal, but he also could be a pedophile. Wouldn't that suck? I did it, Uncle Ozpin. Well, whatever weird magic this is doesn't come with an infinite supply of money. <laughs> I'm afraid you'll have I, I saved the day. All right, now let's get to diddling. Ah! Here. What smells like hazelnut? It's my parfum. Thanks, creepy stranger. Is he a bad guy, though, if he... Oh. Don't let such a small obstacle block your path. You his dad! You be his dad, Hazel! Is that racist on my end yeah. to say that's his dad, because they're... <laughs> I felt... Who is he? Someone from my past. Someone who should not be taken lightly. <laughs> my former lover. Ospin. I want to see that. Where's my cat lesbians? Are they all dead? I say that knowing full well that Yuri does not only mean lesbian, by the way. I'm just making the memes. I say that because I know I will get hundreds of comments if I don't explain that I'm memeing it up. I don't wanna... What's this episode about? Oh, uh, people call Ryan an asshole. Why is the town so burnt? Uh, Any of these places look like a pharmacy? Is Crow okay? Or is that just supposed to be Honestly, footsteps? To I hope that wasn't him breathing. Because he may be I'm mutating. Sure he didn't want to come here, did he? <gasps> My bike! <laughs> That's right, right. Pee Wee Herman jokes, that'll you know bring him home. Why? I think I have a pretty good idea. Uh, oh no, is this Ren's town? Mm. <laughs> Why, hello, little lie. Are we trying to catch a fish? <laughs> For some reason, I, found a flower on the wall. I really thought she'd be like, Hello, little girl! Oh shit! I fricked up! Can we take it home and Man, Ren, you were just a little trap back then, weren't you? No kidnapping. But I'll tell you what you can do. Take this Leon and go find something nice for your father's return. He's been hunting for quite some time. I bet the journey's been. Very I trust tight, a child you? with a credit card. Yes. Do you think you'll know what he wants? I think he wants a water flower in the garden. Oh God, he's so freaking cute! <laughs> <laughs> Am I a man or a woman? I don't know. I'm going through a phase. I'm fat boy. <laughs> I'm a five-year-old. Can you give me a sword? <laughs> well, something just your <laughs> There we go. And he could be like sore in the first freaking part of the game. Suck it, please. <laughs> You didn't even give him apple juice. Come on, man. Gotta have apple juice for these occasions. <gasps> Cat bread! I'm sorry. This is a monumental occasion when you show me things like that. That was the Y levels of awesomeness. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! You're eating bread! Eh, nerd! Oh god, we are actually making fun of her because she's eating bread, huh? Well, you're not moldy, so, you know, she took your advice, bud. 
Where'd she come from? Oh, God, is that the, supposed to be Nora? Because I could see Nora biting people still today. <laughs> Ooh, your dad looks cool. What is happening? I say that about any man with facial hair and long hair. <laughs> oh god, that run. Oh god, that run. You can't Ryan, you can't laugh at a homeless child. But that run. Oh my you god. To run with the rest of them? You're my dad! Why would I run? Sometimes the worst action to take is taking no action at all. Hmm. Go home. I need to speak with the mayor. <laughs> We're getting those kids ex <laughs> exiled. <laughs> you get them, Daddy Ren. Get them out of this freaking country. <laughs> Just like really banish them. Nothing. There's some kids exiled over here. <laughs> Sorry, it's Fred Crow. Oh, Fred. Oh, sweet blueberry jam. Ah, more poison. Ah, why I do that? Also, you see me do a retake, thinking I could cut that out. I can't. There's a video I'm watching. <coughs> Can't cut that out either. This sucks. <laughs> this is all my fault. I should have never dragged you guys into this. What's it? Their idea? We wanted to come. But you didn't know about Tyrion, about Ruby. We lost. We lost Pyrrha. <laughs> you lost her too. And Penny, and your team, and in a way. Your sister. Roman do. I'm just laughing because he's bringing it up here. now on episode 10. Despite everything you've lost and everything you could still lose, you chose to come out here because you felt like you could make a difference. You didn't drag us along. You gave us the courage to follow you. My uncle's still dying, though. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing makes uh, emotional seem more emotional when man vomits up blueberry jam. Oh, we're back to baby Wren. Why, get up, we have to go. It's a horror movie on television, it scared me. Oh, this is gonna be bad, isn't it? Lee! On! What are you doing? That's not a gun, Daddy Ren. You can go to the safe house. You're not doing this anime right. I saw the beast. We need a huntsman. And you two need to leave. What? Is that a monster or a volcano? Could be both in this anime, I'm gonna be honest. It's okay, darling. Everything's okay. <laughs> Oh, would have been better if it was an anvil. I'm gonna be honest. I really, I oh god, Ryan, you just laughed at Ren's mom dying. Oh, I feel like such a piece of shit. I did not see that coming. I thought it was gonna happen afterwards. It happened so fast. What's going on? It's a bad time to tell you I don't get your shoes, Dad. Like, shoes are supposed to also prevent you stubbing your toe. That's just like extra toe. What the frick is that? Listen to me, son. You have to be brave now. Do you understand? No, please, please, I can't. If you leave me, all I'll be left is this homeless guy who laughed at my mom dying. I can't. I can't do that. Take action, son. And I can't do it either, Ren. I can't do it either. 
Your mother and I love you. Um. I don't want to be a stickler, but technically loved. <laughs> eh, sorry, I'll shut up. Cause she's dead. Never mind, Ryan. You've already dug your hole. You can't explain your hole. Hey, Ren. I know how you feel, bud. I feel like I'm down here too. And up there, instead of giant birds for me, it's it's Ruby fans that are gonna torch me. Oh. You're being too negative, girl. You know what that means? Makes a giant monster crow come out. Oh, don't cry. Why, why, why would he not cry? Don't cry. This is not a cry about bud. Flower's still okay? Oh, guys, this is so immensely sad. What a perfect time to get your aura, am I right? Wait, semblance? Or it's one of them. I think aura. Why do I always forget? Four seasons and I still can't get it right. And almost certain it's Aura. We have to be brave. Says the guy who just got his aura. Oh she got his little dust on her cheek. Oh my goodness, that's so adorable. Now she too has it. Oh, can the monster not hear it? Or you know. See the negativity, you know, that they feed off of. Is that Ren's semblance? Like, holy shit, what is that? What is twitching? Is that his giant dick? We can't just go past it. It's a horse. I, y you do? I just saw horse dick. <laughs> oh, Mister, that was an arm actually, right? It's okay. What are you, are you gonna bop him with a mallet? We'll keep each other safe. What's your name? Nora. <laughs> My name's Lyren. Your name's not Ren, it's Lyren? Did I know this? <laughs> I was just gonna say I did. We never get the easy path, do we? Easy's no fun anyway. Oh, the heart in her shirt! Why did I not notice that? Why did she cut it out though? That's probably some sad business there. I've got you here, don't I? Please don't die. Come on. Ye There's more than one way up the mountain. Grenades? Ryan and Nora are gonna come across that horse monster, I see, in, aren't they? I suppose there's only one way to find. <laughs> yes, yes. Very funny. Hey, what's wrong? I bet a troll threw that at you. Don't get on my cave. Shion village. Shion? But that's. That's the village where we found the huntsman. It's weeks away from here. Fred? Wait! Who boy, what's going on? Uh-oh. Something bad. Oh my gosh. That's a lot of dead people.
Oh, is that hoof again? Oh boy. Uh oh. No. It was the Y! <laughs> Well, 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 that was an intense ass episode and kind of depressing. I have to say kind of depressing. We just watched friends, mom and dad get freaking killed. Well, you know what I think it is with flashbacks. I feel like when you know somebody's going to die, it's harder to connect with the scene and feel like super sad, especially when you add a character that's like, Usually with flashbacks, it's like, here's the character that's gonna die. Here's about, like, five seconds of the kind of person they are, like, buying potatoes. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna buy this potato. Pap! Dead! <laughs> there you go. That was, like, the character arc. I'm gonna be honest, though. The freaking Nora and Ren thing. It hit me right there. But hey, maybe Ren and Nora will beat the shit out of the, the, one of the four horsemen or whatever. I don't know. I don't want to freaking get near him. You see that thing slopping around on the ground? I know they say they got dicks like baby arms, but... I didn't think it was that accurate. <laughs> uh, uh, oh, ship time! <laughs> that was a good intro, I gotta say. Hi, everybody. It's Future Ride. Who has some fun ships for this episode? Today's ship... Is Mr. Maple Leaf himself. Um. Gura. I don't know how to say that. I would say Gura, but there's an H there, so it's Gura. How have I not heard? I think it's because no one's actually said his name. They've always just called him Dad. So I don't know. It's the, it's, it's Blake's dad. We're going to see what it'd be like with that big masculine piece of meat. Gets on top of some characters. Wow, it's really, it's really weird now that I said that because, you know, half of these characters are girls. Young girls. It's only okay when he's plowing his wife, I gotta say. But, uh, who cares? Let's go, boys. Let's see what this is about. I'm disappointed Andy is not on this list. Why is Andy not banging his former boss? I think former boss. I don't know how that works. <coughs> I'm beautiful, I know. Gira versus, oh, you know what the worst part is? I know if I'm saying it wrong, this whole entire ship list's gonna piss off everybody. I uh, apologies, I don't know how to say his name. Um, I'm not gonna look it up. <laughs> Gira versus Ruby. Mowgli. It's the bare necessities. Was that the movie? I don't freaking know. I didn't watch, I watched that movie, it was like five. Gira versus Weiss. Polar bear. Is this technically spoiling the fact that he could be a bear? Is he a bear? Is that what's going to go on? Is that what his animal thing is? I don't know. Uh, it could also be the fact that he's a big hairy man. But at the same time, if you're a bear and a man and you're having sex with women, are you technically a bear? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know the, the lingo. I do like some symbols. Them gay lingos. <laughs> what? What? All right, this is two men going together. All right, this is this is me. Not knowing, I'm away from the gay sex because I I like women, but I'm also I don't have any women, so I'm still alone. <laughs> these are th these are you. These are you. I'm Gary. I almost am certain that this is a a gang symbol, so I'm gonna gonna put my hands down for a gang that I don't know comes to my house and says you're in I'm like oh shit <coughs> oh oh <laughs> no <laughs> who put who put a fire in my room it got really hot all of a sudden because uh this next one's a doozy I'm just gonna say what Matt said before he says I really don't like this one he actually warned me. He said ahead of time that there was one that he really, really didn't like. And, uh, 
The uncomfortable chills, folks. <laughs> A daddy X Blake. Makes me want to go back to time with Crow and Ruby. Kittens cream. <coughs> <coughs> no! Imagination! This is not the time to show up here. I'm going to be honest with you. That is... Oh, that... Oh, that is the worst. Congratulations, uh, shippers. You have officially created the worst ship name of them all. That, I mean, the pun ones are bad, but not on this level. This is a whole nother level. All right, let's just go. Let's just move on so that I can feel a lot better. Uh, Gira X Blang, uh, Smokey Bear. <laughs> It's technically Smokey the Bear Internet, you crazy kooks. Uh, Gira X John. Oh, God. Baghira? All right, folks, you know what this is? This is a Google box moment. Oh, it's the lion from the Jungle Book. Gira X Nora. Gaga. Ja Wait, no. No, Gaga's a, a G, right? This is J, so it's Jaga. Is that the snake? Let's find out. <laughs> well, I guess I'm not getting answers for this one unless you guys know it. And I'm, there's always one person who knows, but uh, when I looked it up, <laughs> it's, it's, it's this old man from Thundercats. It could be that. I mean, it kind of fits the theme. Gira X Pira. That just sounds fun to say, isn't it? Ferocious. Gira X Ren. Teetoddlers. Let's, let's say it again, because I don't think that's toddler. Is that toddlers? Or is that toddlers? Because if it's toddlers, I feel immensely uncomfortable. The per practice of promotion of complete personal abstinence and alcoholic beverage. Good enough. Yeah, I get it. I'm just uh, teetoddlers. Oh, frick! Teetoddlers. Whatever. You get the point. If it's toddlers, I feel immensely uncomfortable. Gira X Sun. Can't let them get away. Seems the coffee table jokes were not that far off. <laughs> Gira X Penny. Grinding my gearas. Okay, so hear me out, guys. Hear me out. Hear me out. I like this one because now I feel confident about the way I'm saying his name. <laughs> Gira X Roman, cat burglar. I like it, but I also imagine them having passionate anal sex. So, ow, my virgin eyes. Gira X Crow, grumpy cat. <coughs> Gear X Jock, good dad, bad dad. Gira X Kali, Faunus Pride. Oh, that's that's his mom. Oh, his, his mom. Oh God, way to make it even worse. Uh, his wife, and I agree because they are the cutest little family ever. Ah, uh, I really like Grumpy Cat, but we're going with the it grinds my gears. <laughs> I don't know. Memes, that's why, all right? Memes. I'm dying inside, folks. That kitten. <clears throat> that kitten. Think of another word for it, Ryan. Kitten butter. No, it made it worse! Frick it. We're not mentioning it. That was the worst. That was the worst. Hands down. That's the worst. Anyways, uh, so I'll see you later, everybody. I gotta go vomit profusely. Bye-bye. Hey!